Hey YouTube guys, so this is a video I've been wanting to make for a very, very long time. I've just been waiting for the company to actually send me the controller. I've been wanting to do this review for, for a while because I saw my friend So Superior actually did this kind of comparison and it made me want to try something new. I want to try a different controller. Um, and so right here guys, we're going to be doing a Scuff Gaming comparison. Uh, controller versus a uh, battle beaver controller. Uh, this is a new company that like basically makes the same first person shooter controllers And it's it's pretty good man So we're gonna get to the comparison really quickly and then the, I'm gonna do a gameplay with the battle beaver And then a second another gameplay with the scuff controller and I'm just gonna tell you guys how I'm feeling and stuff like that guys So scuff I've been using the scuff since like since oh when I was on 360 Xbox 360 I've been using the scuff for a while man. They've been reliable. They're very since like like very well established company, right? But they've been changing things uh they've been changing some things over the last couple of years and i feel like scuffs aren't as durable or as like well, they don't last that long anymore so i actually have two scuff controllers sitting over here that are broken that i've had in the last like six months man so this 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 paddles like broke like the end like the interior like the buttons in the back don't really work anymore when i press them and then this like the interior of this scuff like doesn't work so i don't even know man so so the scuff controller right uh they now they no longer use the ps4 6 so this is a ps4 controller they no longer use the ps4 6 they use their own little um their little sticks the scuff sticks i don't like at all i don't think it's good I, it really doesn't last that long it's already sorry look it's already tearing for me on this little stick and it just makes it uncomfortable the ps4 sticks are so much more comfortable than um uh, than the scuff sticks and then, but I think a scuff is really comfortable because of the scuff grips in the back. Very, very comfortable. My hands never sweat with these. Very, very good, right? Also, the paddles have made it really comfortable. I'm gonna be lying, paddles are amazing. Like, just, just the thought of like, when they actually work. The fact is they don't work that often. Like, they'll break a lot. The, the idea of a paddle is great, but the fact that like the execution of it was horrible because the buttons in the back usually sometimes don't work. And then the scuff paddles break really easily because they're just kind of like, they're kind of out more and kind of vulnerable to like just a little bit of pressure and boom, it snaps. So that's one of the problems with it. Um, but a scuff controller is really, really comfortable. Um, I've been, get, I've gotten used to it over the years. So, you know, it's probably one of the most comfortable controllers you can actually have, man. And, uh, and stuff like that. A base scuff controller is probably 120 just to get paddles on it and stuff like that without any customization and all that good stuff, man. But let's get into this. Uh, this is the Battle Beaver controller. The minute I started playing with this weapon, I should have got grips on the back of it. My hands were sweating so bad, bro. Like, I've never had my hands sweat in a Call of Duty match like that ever before. It was like I was playing basketball or something, like an actual sport, not an eSport. But yeah, guys, so the buttons on the back are like... It's so much more natural because you're so used to clicking buttons on a regular controller. Now you have buttons on the back, so it's a lot more natural. Um, the problem with this is I should have got the buttons maybe a little bit lower. Um, it's because I have big hands, so it's kind of uncomfortable to kind of click them and stuff like that. I feel like I got to stretch my arms out and stuff like like stretch my hands out, my fingers out and stuff like that, guys. Also, these came with trigger stops, which you could probably get them on a scuff, but these have trigger stops. I'm not really a fan of the trigger stops um, just because it feels weird. I don't really like it too much. Because I feel like if I press too hard, it's going to like break or something like that. It's not natural, but um, pretty cool idea, I guess. They kept the PS4 sticks, which is a great, great addition. You know, the PS4 sticks are so much more comfortable than the scuff sticks, in my personal opinion. So, overall, guys, I think the Battle Beaver is a great idea controller. Um, you know, they're a pretty new company, so they can execute a lot of things. And the customization compared to this on the scuff controller you can get is unimaginable. Like, you can get, like... It's, you can basically build your own controller, which is kind of a little bit too, a little a lot of work, but you can basically build your own controller from the ground up to make it like godlike. So, um, you get let me know what you guys think, guys. Just I'm not bashing scuff, but it's just the idea of a scuff is awesome, but they just don't last that long. So I'm gonna and in the future, if you guys want me to make a second video on this, uh, drop a like, smash like, shoot for two thousand likes on today's video, man. Um, the, so you're gonna see a gameplay with the battle beaver, and then you're gonna see a gameplay with the scuff. So enjoy, guys. Stay humble, stay blessed, man. Um, I'm really liking the Battle Beaver though right right now. It's really really good man So enjoy the, enjoy the gameplay guys. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about a scuff controller What do you guys have and if if you don't have the money to buy any of these controllers just use stick and move It's a button layout for you guys This is just for the people who want a comparison and all that good stuff man And because you guys can trust my opinions I'm not sponsored by any of these companies to get paid to say anything good about them So drop a like stay up and say blessed dudes and I'll see you guys later. Alright YouTube this game 
We're going to be rocking the Battle Beaver here. As you guys see, it has the buttons on the back of it. Um, I'm going to tell you guys about it and stuff like that as I'm talking through the game. Um, I use a couple of different score streaks and stuff like that for you guys. Um, I just keep it entertaining, man. I want to switch up some stuff like that. Keep the gameplays fresh. Don't always want to use the same streaks. But, guys, the Battle Beaver, I can tell you right now, the buttons feel so much more natural than the paddles, man. It feels so more com I feel way more comfortable as I've been playing with it, man. It's been, it's been a blast, dude. I've been having a lot more fun with the buttons. It feels like a natural movement. Dude, I don't even understand how you just blast me like that. What the hell? Alright, we're gonna go and push middle map here. I think I heard a guy over here. There we go. He's one shot. I got a flank, dude. What did I just get hit with? Oh my gosh, dude. The synaptic people are the worst, man. Jesus. Any help? No? Okay, cool. This guy's going to come right down here. Yep, he's going to come right here. Yeah, you're obvious, sir. We got a vulture. Let's go. Nice little vulture. I think there's going to be a guy. Yeah, here. And right here. Get out, Vulture. Good stuff, baby. Way to come in clutch for your boy. Yeah, man, I really like the buttons. That's one of the best things about the Battle Beaver. Also cheaper, too. I cannot tell you guys about longevity. That's one thing I cannot tell you guys about because I, I haven't had this super long, so... There you go. I put my sentry gun like right in a good place too. Holy crap. That's a really good spot for a sentry gun. It's a really good spot. We don't have a UAV yet. Or is, I don't. They're up top. Oh, there we go. I got an UAV now. This guy's right here. There's two multiple guys right here. We go. Let's go. Let's to you, boys, boys and girls. Okay, dude, they are all up top. Oh my gosh, look at all these dudes. Every single one of these guys just. Okay, well, okay. I love getting hit by that. Oh, they got here. Yes, not. Well, what's your guys' experience with a scuff, man? Come on, I want you guys to peek. Yeah, he has a shot. He has a... There we go. Call this in right here. They're going to be right here, probably. Ah, oh, he just shotguns me, man. Yeah, so... Yeah, just my past experience, man. My scuff, uh, it's never lasted super long, man. I've had so many different, just, uh, just different problems with them and stuff like that. But Battle Beaver, just for the couple of days, man. The buttons are, like, the most positive thing I can give you guys right now and stuff like that, man. But scuff is a lot more comfortable on the hands. Besides the buttons, the controller is kind of, I don't know, it's the way the buttons are placed. It isn't very like good for my hands because my hands are really big so I, I think I would get a different placement and also I'm not, I don't really like the trigger stops that's these right here these are like the trigger stops so I barely have to even tap it to shoot I, have to, I barely just go like that and it shoots so um, I don't know really about those especially when you're using like the mammoth and the burst weapons very very weird like I really you can shoot it fast but you're not used to it so kind of like I don't know it's it's a lot different man so Overall, Battle Beaver buttons, awesome, great idea, very, very revolutionary, some that people, I don't know how, why they haven't thought of that sooner, as soon as Scuff came out, but, yeah. Alright guys, this game, we are going to be rocking with the Scuff here, last game I did the Battle Beaver, now we're going to be doing the Scuff here, man, and the thing about the Scuff is that, the thing I don't like about it is they have their own little Scuff sticks now, so like, they don't use the, they no longer make uh, Scuffs with their own PS4 sticks, they use their own thumbsticks, which I really hate, I don't like that at all. Oh my god. The entire team is there. Okay. The entire team is there. Nice. I gotta watch my back over here. You are now in the lead. 
The guy over there? Got that dude. I'm gonna hit the flank here now. But yeah, man, the buttons are a lot easier. Paddles just they just break so easily, dude. Got a vulture, let's go. They're gonna spawn back here, watch. Yeah, I literally called that one, dude. That's that's such a strong spawn point. Oh my god, shoot them all! Shoot them all! Shoot them all! Shoot them all! I'm gonna put this back here. Can I please put this back here? Thank you. There we go. That's a perfect spot for a sentry gun, bro. Literally perfect. Holy crap. I'm gonna try to push this real quick. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna go ahead and push this. Help me! Sentry gun! I need you! Sentry gun! Sentry gun! There we go. Where are these guys at, man? So, scuff, you know, it's just, it doesn't last very long. I've had so many scuffs just break on me, bro. Yeah, I'm dead. Bye, guys. I've had so many scuffs just break on me, bro. They follow me? No, they're not. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is too hectic, man. This is too hectic. Oh my god, dude, we're going off here. Yeah, but I like the I like the thumbsticks a lot better. I love the buns a lot better for the battle beaver. Yeah, I mean a scuff's a scuff, man. Go ahead and put the sentry gun right there. Roll our way back this way. But let me know what you guys think, man. I think you guys should definitely give a battle beaver a try if you haven't, man. Just to try something different. You know what I'm saying? Just to try something different, man. Okay, someone shot my sentry gun. Jeez, okay. Got advanced UAV. Got advanced UAV. Tell your girl she want me. I'm gonna go ahead and flank this way. Please don't spawn there. Okay, he didn't spawn there. Woo! Let's go, dudes. But I think it's just something to di something to try differently, man. If you always have scuffs that break, definitely just give Battle Beaver a try, man. Link will be in the description. I'm not sponsored by them like that. Just try something different, man. You already, this, dude, the synaptic character is so hard to hit, man. I've always hated the synaptic characters. We dropped a jug. Holy crap. Ha <laughs> ha That's not because of the scuff. You don't, don't, no, no, don't be like, uh, it's because of the scuff swag. Nah, fam, chillax. It's just because your boy has your skiz skizzies. Hope you guys enjoyed today's gameplay. Make sure you guys go ahead and drop a like. Let me know what you guys' opinions are so far. You, some of you guys, most of you guys haven't even tried the Battle Beaver yet. But let me know what you guys thought of like the gameplays and just me showing you the controllers and just explaining and stuff like that. I'm really curious to what you guys think. If you can't afford it, there's always Stick and Move, which is a de default layout you can use. Um, which is pretty cool, but I don't like it too much because it's not comfortable for my movement. But um, yeah, man. So let me know what you guys think. Drop a like. I've been following your trail, you don't hide it well Yeah, I should've played it safe, kept my eye on you